Hey, hello everybody and welcome back to some more Lord of the Rings Online. We are here in the Great Delving, or Moria, or whatever you want to call it, depending on where we are specifically, and the event, the festival, that is, is still currently going on. However, because we've basically done everything except the shrew stomping thing, which I don't really feel like would be a good video on its own, I thought we'd come back and actually, you know, do... The quests around here and another good thing I realized I'll do my uh, my hobby gifts in a second but the reason we were originally here the first thing we tried to do as soon as we got here was get iron garrison miners uh, reputation and the reason for that is because by doing that we could get our travel skill to the 21st hall which is something we do badly need and I found out looking at this one this actually gives me iron garrison miners uh, rep so I'm hoping that continues as a trend because that'll be great because then we can just do part of the main epic quest stuff and we can be getting experience and uh, also we can be getting reputation which is what we need uh, this we can't pick up sages lockies yet unfortunately yeah so while we are traveling there let's have a look at our hobby gifts of the day because we have uh, a silver for the day 190 marks that is good and our gold for the week let's have a look at what that is a Madam Hunter's armor. Oh, so close to being a fine Madam Hunter's armor. That would have been a real great thing to have. So, uh, not amazing, but not terrible. And now we need to make our way over to Durin's Way to get to the Chamber of Crossroads to talk to Bossy or Bossy or uh, whatever you're supposed to say. I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. Um, or at least this is the way I used to go to get here. Unless I'm thinking about a different place, potentially. I don't know. I just remember these guys attacking me last time. And then you got dropped down here. And then you go up here, and then you go across there, and then you're in this place, and then you go through Durin's Way, and then you get there. So I think we are correct. We just have to make sure we don't fall, because there are cracks in the ground, and we will have to jump over them, because if we don't, we're kind of dead. And I don't think we want to be dead. So, yeah, we will, uh, that's just the token of a homework. Uh, we will discover this place, that's good, the Dwarf Lord's Gate. We will need to make sure at some point we come through here and collect all the exploration deed parts. Uh, luckily we're at the point where these guys aren't going to be attacking us, so these guys are generally around level 53. Uh, so we are about 10 levels above them, or probably 9 levels, because there's, there's going to be some guys which are a bit higher level uh, than just the bats that are around here. But we should be able to come down here, if I remember correctly, it's down here, and through this little area here to the Chamber of Crossroads, or Chamber of the Crossroads, uh, which will open up a ton of more quests for us, which is good. We're going to have a Stable Master, so we can quickly get back here if we want to. Uh, once we get to the 21st Hall, we'll talk to that guy, and we can get, uh, we'll discover the route, obviously, and then we'll have swift travel to and from. Uh, well, hopefully back to here as well. Let's complete your quest. What's your next one? Defeat Gred Big. Within the Great Delving, okay? Basically, defeat an enemy a certain amount of times. Uh, where are they? And it's going to be in the Great Delving, so it's going to be down here. So, back up this way should be basically the way we just came. And uh, let's also get this deed out of the way. New deed, that's why it came up. But uh, 12 of these things, they can't be too difficult, I don't think. I don't know specifically what enemy they are. They could quite easily be these uh, these things. No, they're not, otherwise it will probably show. Uh, also, I think that's part of a quest. Yeah, that will start a quest in itself. There are a lot of those in Moria. A lot of ones where, you know, you go into an area, you suddenly have five quests pending uh, for you to accept. You also have a ton of, you know, items that you can click on and it will suddenly give you a quest. It's actually pretty good. Uh, because you can get quite a lot done here. So if you need the rep, I guess it's always nice. So what are we after? Let's uh, make sure we're in the area. We are going to have to, I guess, press uh, backspace. Are you what I'm after? Yeah, you're what I'm after. Let's kill you then. Except you are quite powerful. Because <laughs> obviously these guys are, you know, fairly high level still. Uh... Okay, so I don't know if they're going to be in the Mori. I don't think they're in the same place as these guys. I don't think they uh, they kind of play well with each other sort of thing. So we are going to have to have a little bit of a look around. There's a quest ring up here, so I wonder who uh, is going to give us a quest around this area. 
Wick fast. Iron garrison miners, please? No, nope, guards. Gonna leave you for the moment, motion. sorry. I want to kill these guys first. These are my priority because I want to get these quests done. Um, I'll try and do this quest minimum. This shouldn't take too long, assuming the, uh, the guys aren't too far uh, apart from each other, which it doesn't look like they're too badly, uh, you know, spread apart. But we'll do this. We'll do, uh, you know, focusing on the epic quests this time. I know I said I'm going to do, uh, try and do all of them, and I have a ton in here. I should have, you know, well, a few, like, these ones are ready to complete. In fact, we might actually put these on, considering they're ready, um, to get that extra rep. But for the most part, you know, progression plus, uh, rep is always a nice, uh, combination to have. So, are we out of the place yet? No, we're not. Okay, there should be... Okay, they're not going to be up here. That's not going to be great. But, my question is... Where can I complete these quests? Where do these quests get completed? Are they in the Silverstone, uh, Silverstone Loads? I think they are down here. Yeah, so we'll do this quest, I think. Then we will... Uh, we'll go down to there, complete those. Hopefully, if I'm pressing all the right buttons, which I'm really not today... Uh, hopefully what we can do is Iron Garrison Miners get a bit of XP. It's 10k to the next tier, so I don't feel like we're gonna get there anytime really soon. I mean, again, we could quite easily just pick up rep items um, from the Skirmish Camp, which I might do now that I think about it. It's, it's really showing me how, like, not... Well, not difficult, but time-consuming it is to actually do this. I mean, these guys, I'm looking for eight more enemies, and it's very, you know, <laughs> they're pretty spread apart. Um, like, it's not, they don't seem to be in all the areas that are shown, because I guess these enemies are taking up uh, their spaces, maybe? Okay, we got a few more, so it looks like we might be getting uh, a bit luckier now. I can't... Oh, I can't bear to think about uh, how it's going to be for when we do D tier. Because all these, as you may have noticed, like the two Sladies we've got so far are all uh, kill 100 for the lowest tier. But that's going to take forever. Though, you can see from our uh, log here that we do get some nice items out of it. So why is that glowing? Do you count? You might count. I think they count. Yeah, they do. Good. But we, uh, if we have to do 100 of each of them, uh, or 50 if we use the, um, obviously a, a accelerator, where's our goat? There it is. Uh, we can get heritage runes out of these things, and also reputation items, so we will be using those. Um, I think it's alt, yep. And heritage runes, as I said, which we can go towards leveling up our weapons, and considering, uh, you know, as you can see, this is actually level 58 Nearly at level 59, 60, 60 is its max tier. As soon as we get 60, um, I actually want to go up this way, don't I? Uh, as soon as we get to 60, then we can, hopefully by that time, we will be able to get a new weapon, but we can deconstruct and get some nice stuff out of that. So that'll be uh, a pretty cool thing there. I wish I just went back here. These guys could have been uh, easy kills. I, d I thought it might have been these guys. I didn't know if they counted, though. Um, and a few here. But, we have those deeds. Uh, we have this quest now complete. We'll see what his next quest is. Also, I want to see what this... Okay, this doesn't actually give us any rep. So, uh, not too good. But these only give us 300 and 300. So, again, they're not even that good. This gives me 700. So, again, better. Not perfect, but better. Uh, so, that would be 1,300, which is... Well, if we only did one of these and then we did this one, that's, you know, 1,000. But 1,300, which is, let's say, a tenth of the way there. Um, but, again, rep items might be the way to go at this point, considering how uh, how long it's taken to do this and how much I actually have to get done and how needy we kind of are of having to get here, you know, quickly. I wouldn't mind... Just getting to uh, the first tier, getting that done, getting the skill, and then leveling up uh, or our reputation through quest from that point onwards. I think I would actually be happy to do that, 
It's just the, uh, the leveling up of that, so... Oh, these are... This is, like, quest that takes forever. Okay, so we're definitely not going to be doing that today. Um, I think because this is requires us to do three different quests... Um, no, it doesn't. It requires us to just go around. Um, I thought it was the one where you have to do three different sets of quests. Uh, but I think... I know I said I was going to do it, but I think what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'll do these quests separately, because I think I might actually have to go down here. There's this one, this one, and... Oh, no. But if I've got to go near the Dolven View, I, I guess I can go down here and complete those quests. Or I'll go down here first, and then start next episode here, complete those two quests, and then go up and do those in the next episode. So, that's going to be it for now, however. Uh, getting closer to comp getting through here, getting closer to having... Uh, you know, on level quests. I mean, this is a level 56 quest, this is level 53, uh, only 10 levels off compared to what we were previously doing. And also uh, getting closer to getting that skill, which is going to be a really nice thing when we get it. Uh, so I might also look into some other quests which give us uh, or like the best way of getting the good rep straight away. Uh, so we don't actually have to spend our marks, which would probably be, uh, be best if we can do that. But that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.